34 years after the establishment of the Federal University of Technology at Wawiri, host communities are demanding adequate compensation from the Maritime School Management for the piece of land. They are accusing the university authority of being insensitive to their plight as host communities after giving out over 4,000 hectares of land to the university. This is coming just as youths from the communities allegedly attacked the university premises, damaging properties worth millions of naira. It might have been rosy all this while, going by the level of development attracted by the Federal University of Technology Oweri into Iyagwa, Iziobodo, Obinze, and Okolochi communities in Oweri West, local government area of Imo State. More than 60% of the students live in these communities. Only a few days ago, it was alleged that a group of youths, numbering over 200 from the host communities, came on a violent protest, accusing the university of taking over their land for over three decades without adequate compensation. Broken doors, windows, ceilings, and office furniture are what is left of the attack. All they did in here to distract and they started them, you know, destroying the buildings. We saw very close they brought, they started looting. They looted a lot of properties. They brought very close and started loading away our cement, carrying all the, the GP tanks, the sumo, the block industries. In fact, they vandalized the whole real estate. Even ongoing projects, like the construction of the staff quarters, were not spared. But the school authority claims it's living up to its corporate social responsibility. Well, the land has been given to the university. I hold it in trust for the federal government and the council does the same thing. We're not quarreling with the state with the close communities. We have with our friends. The, the, the community liaison officer is from that place. But most members of the community are employed from that communities. So we are in good relationship with them in terms of employment, in terms of admission, in terms of minor contracts, the ones anybody can do. Traditional ruler of one of the host communities said the protest might have been triggered by negative utterances from the school management during one of their meetings. What has happened? We regret it. We don't like it. Nobody wants it. But it, I think they caused it by the interactions. Especially the last meeting we held with the person side of the university, it was devastating. When he was able to tell our people, you tell somebody whose father, whose mother's farmland has been taken away, you tell him he is not a landlord, he is a neighbor. That's what that's the word the person seller used on our people that day. In spite of what has happened, both parties have resolved to handle the issue amicably as an urgent meeting is scheduled to hold soon. Meanwhile, more security personnel have been deployed to the school to prevent further attacks.